All right, gear, look at this flashlight that I got sent me. It's in quite a nice pouch. It's got two loops on the back that you can put on your belt. There's one for smaller belts, which is sewn on. So it's sewn at the bottom there, so it's pretty secure. And then you can put your smaller, thinner belt through there. Or if you've got a thicker belt, there's this one here, which buttons up. And that can also be used to attach it to a pack or something. There's also a plastic D loop at the top there to attach it to a pack. And there's a button at the front there that you press, you know, just basic plastic clip to open it up. Slide that out, this like grommet in the bottom there, stop it from filling with water or anything. And then the torch slash flashlight itself, pretty solid. I mean, this thing feels like it would take a bit of a beating. It's got rubber grip on either side there, molded for your fingers, and a three finger grooves on each side, so it's comfortable to hold. And you've got the button on the top here to activate it, but if you just press it, nothing happens. You have to spin that button a few times to unlock it, which is actually quite handy because if you've got this in your pack or attached to your belt and you accidentally knock it and were to turn it on, that would drain all the battery. And when you go to use it, it's no good. So I do quite like this feature, even though it takes a bit of getting used to that you have to just spin that a few times to turn it on. Now with this button, on this side, when you turn the wheel and turn it on, it will show you how much battery is left. See those four green lights there. And bearing in mind, I've been using this flashlight all last night, it's still fully charged. And I spin that to show me how much battery is left, all three green lights are on. Then on the other side, when you turn it, the green lights indicate how many lumens you're using. So you can gradually turn that up to full power. or turn it down for a dimmer light. And obviously the more looms you're using, the quicker the battery's gonna run out. But as I say, this was the only light source I was using last night. And so for, you know, for a good few hours, I was using this and the battery hasn't gone down at all. So that's pretty impressive. And to charge this up, I've never had a flashlight like this before. Uh, you get a charger with it that you can plug into a USB port or plug it into a, uh, plug with a USB connector to it but when you put it on the end there it actually magnetizes on to charge up so you magnetize the charger on the top there and the lights green when it's fully charged and it'll be red while it's charging they've actually got a summer sale on at the minute so I'll leave a link in the description if you're interested in this and want to take a look you can see it's gone red there because it's charging that'll turn to green once it's fully charged if I open it up, I'll show you the battery that comes with it. I like light brand battery. I assume you can get spares of those uh, if it ever goes wrong. There is a little hole in the end there where you can put a lanyard if you want, but it doesn't come with a lanyard. I don't tend to use them very much, but it would have been nice if it was included. But if you've got one spare, you can put it in there. It's got a kind of beveled edge there, tactical style. And there are four bulbs. It's also quite handy for me because it fits in this bracket that I have on my bicycle. So I can use it as a bike light as well. With this flashlight here it's not in focus but you can adjust the light settings on it to make it brighter like that. or dimmer and it's got quite a range of lumens that it goes from from duller to lighter You can also have it flashing as a strobe effect like that. Or just the regular light. So I'll leave a link in the description to where you can get these from. As I say, this was sent to me for free, so there is an element of shilling to this, I'll admit. But uh, I am giving my honest opinion of it as well, and it is a really good little flashlight. So uh, 
check it out if you're into that sort of thing like me who can never get enough torches and flashlights I would say I got a ridiculous amount now knives and flashlights more than I will ever use got the Olight EDC flashlight as well which is not as powerful as this but it's a lot thinner and lighter and more suitable for EDC uh, everyday carry rather than this which is a you know a bit chunkier a bit heavier and really you'd need to have on a belt clip which not everyone wants to have it looks you know a bit tactical having it on your belt uh, so if you want one that just slides in your pocket this is quite a good one but they've got a sale on at the minute over the next few days so I'll leave a link in the description so if you want to go over there and see if you can find any discounted that take your fancy the link will be in the description below. Thanks for watching everyone and I'll catch you again soon.